Ahoy folks and welcome back to Broadside Gaming with me Zug. So as you see today we're going to carry on with Stargy Valley. So uh, let's crack on shall we? Right. Let's go say hello to the wife. Damn. Fairies ruining things. Right, let's go check everything. Trees are doing alright, strawberries are doing alright. Alright, time for the animals. Oh, we got some resin. Oops, I forgot to shut their door. Uh, have I found all of them? No, I haven't found Fabo. Oh, they're there. Oh, hey, Frost. Hey, Dean. Dean. Gonna go through the animals. I had some sort of plan, I don't remember what it was. Yeah, I played a little bit off stream this week, man. I wasn't sure if I was actually going to keep doing this like on a Thursday or not, so I just kind of carried on playing. Because my plan was that Dark Tide would be the, the Thursday thing again with all the new features, and then Ugg and I realised they haven't actually added anything to make content out of, like at all. do their thing and we need to go get some hardwood I want some gold or is it iron I need it I think it's iron I need actually first <laughs> a little bit yeah yeah but it's um year two so i only kind of i played through fall winter and spring and winter is just the most boring uh season to play through because there's nat to do I like having animals, man. Fun. And also, they, I make so much money off of them. And this is before I've even got the um, the arts and good stuff set up. So this is like base. I will have to put in one more uh, coop that just has nothing but rabbits in it to get fur and lucky rabbit's feet. Right, we need to go get some iron. Oh, 
And the barns aren't even full yet, only one of them has the max amount of animals in. Which is the one that has pigs. The other two are half empty. I think I'm just going to fill them with more cows and goats for milk production. Although truffles are worth quite a bit, so I don't know. I haven't figured that out yet. Which iron do I have? 15. Yeah, I don't need to buy any. Because I cannot be bothered grinding for ore. The only ore I want to grind for is iridium. Sorted. What do you, I'm just going to go. Use Twenty five grand, ten grand. Yeah, uh, bunnies have been from the outstart. They're not a great money maker, but they're really good for getting everyone to love you. Because you, if you hand out lucky rabbits feet, it's a universal love for everyone. Uh, don't really want to spend the twenty-five grand at the moment, but I kind of should. So I need. A sunflower, a truffle, which I've already got, three apples and some wheat. Not difficult to do that. But I do need to go see Pierre and see if he's selling sunflowers, which he should do. It is summer. So we'll just give a quick look. Uh, there we go. I feel like I need a poppy seed for something, but I can't. Maybe I don't. Oh no, I thought you handed the poppy in, that's fine. So you just need to grow a sunflower. Oh, we'll stick it in that. How long does it take to grow, actually? Eight days. Yeah, we've got time to do that. Yeah, I mean, even if it, they only had that, if you went the Jojo Mart route, so if you went the evil route, you could give people cash gifts. That would have been, That's a very good idea for us. Stick the sunflower here. Dump everything out. How did I put my I don't have very much fiber? Or stone. That's annoying. Oh well. At the moment, I'm just selling the truffles because I haven't got um, a truffle oil machine. I whizzed past it. Oh, there it is. Oil maker. Yeah, I don't have the the necessary setup to like mass produce this stuff yet. <laughs> yep, they definitely should do it like that. Just the evil route is you can just do everything with money. 
Oh yeah, this is my sap collector. Uh, collector. So six of each trees, all with a sap collector on. I'm probably going to end up putting another... Probably another two coops over here, just so they can feed on that side. Because there's a lot of space around there. Got a lot of truffles coming out, that's good. Right, how am I doing for skills? Mining and combat, so I do need to go mess around in the mines a little bit. Oh yeah, I got a new lightning rod, didn't I? got all the fruit trees in they'll just take forever to grow all right, let's go collect those truffles no don't eat the truffle What is this barn have in it? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Okay, so this barn's full. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. <laughs> They're full as well. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So this one could have some more animals in it. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Look, I'm assuming there's twelve. You know, they keep moving. Two, four, six, eight, ten. Yeah. So that's full. Two, four, six, eight, nine. Oh yeah, because one of the cows gave birth. So this can still have. So these two barns need. I might put four pigs in there, and then just another cow and two goats in there. Two, four, six, eight. So this can have another four animals in it as well. Let's just close that. I'll probably pick those up tomorrow. Because once I can get um, a couple of sheds built, I can put in the cheese presses, the mayonnaise machines, and kegs to make wine out of all the fruit. And that's when I start making seriously stupid money. Hey, I do have three apples. There's one. There's two. Okay, we can hand those in. Uh, we are going to sell the truffles, though. Right, I'll go hand these into the uh, community uh, building. So, yeah, I'm going to get four more pigs and then a cow two goats. So that means I'll be making 14 truffles a day during spring, summer and fall. Yeah, that should be good. Right, so I just need wheat now for her. I think 
ancient fruits of the Holy Grail. Oh, hey, Wondering, how are you doing, D? Actually, I'm not sure. I think either are pretty good. I think I'll blow all my money tomorrow and uh, get some more animals. doing well no, I'm so I'm doing the morning greeting so you keep the relationship up but for some reason it's not doing it maybe we'll do it now oh, there you go right, we'll go sort the animals out first and then we'll go and buy some more Very odd shape, the old meadow farm. So I think I'm going to do today. I'm going to sort out the last of the animals for these. Oh, good. The, uh, the last coop's upgraded. Yeah. Right. So this is the one that needs one cow and two goats. Because I accidentally didn't turn off the get pregnant mode on the animals and one just popped up. Alright dude, catching a bit. So we're gonna put two more chickens, two more ducks in here. Now they've got access to plenty of grass, but I'll probably plant some more in a bit. Get out of the way, child. randomly generated names. Let's make sure we purchase the right amount of pigs. Yep. Okay, now one cow and two goats.
and two ducks. Right, that is all of my coops and barns filled. And most of my money gone. But hopefully uh, the pigs will basically make all that money back during autumn when they're all hunting for truffles. And I'll just sell them all straight out. some hardwood oh yeah that's um that's a new thing the the tree they put there in this patch at some point during the year it blows over and if you use a hundred hardwood to repair it it goes oh somebody could move into here and then a raccoon lives in there so there's a little trash panda that wants things oh, all right they catch it a bit I don't have anything he wants, apparently. Ah. I'll just dump all this rubbish off, and then we'll have a quick dip into the mine, see if I can find some iridium. Oh no, I haven't checked the, uh, the greenhouse, have I? Yeah, he wants snails or a smoked bullhead, but I don't actually have any of those on me. So I'm not actually sure what that raccoon gives you. Screw this. Ruby. 
but I don't remember if you can actually get iridium down here or not. Or if you have to wait for the end of year thing, the end of the third year when your granddad gives you the cat statue. Bats. I hate the bloody things. Yeah, it is quite a picky raccoon. I thought, you know, I could give it any sort of fish and it would be happy, but nope. It specifically wants snails and a smoked bullhead. forget about the um, the iridium stuff or was it the desert mine that you have a better chance of finding it but really low down oh no it's a bullhead um, a fish that it wants but it's called a bullhead for some reason Well, at least we're stocked up on gold, I suppose. Right, let's get out of here. Head back to the old farm. Just dump out the old bags. That was easy. Right, we'll go collect our truffles. Did I already hand a truffle in? Oh, yeah, I did. at seven so there might be one hidden around here somewhere maybe I only got six today so a little wander in the grass if there's anything there yeah Oh, well. Oh, yeah, I need to shut the doors, don't I? So I think I managed to plant... Uh just over 550 melons on these patches so we should have a good turnaround at the end of the season Seven thousand five hundred for six truffles. 
Oh, a green rain has descended upon the valley. Your still pan is ready. Well, time to go collect fibre. Yeah, I might have to look it up actually. I just, I just don't remember where. Alright, I'll go sort the animals, then we'll go around and collect all of the. Uh, nice, they're starting to give out. Problem is, when it rains, we don't make any money for the pigs. So they're basically useless in the rainy seasons and winter. But, you know. That's what the other animals are for. Oh yeah, yeah. I was so annoyed about that that I re when I realised you could um, you could just refine the quartz like the normal quartz you found. One sec, guys. And I'm back. Sorry about that. Um, oh, there we go. Sorry, I was just messing with the, the soundboard, just making sure I actually turned everything back on properly. Yeah, finding out that I actually could refine quartz instead of having to mine in. Oh, farm the uh, crystals. I was very upset by that. Yeah, I don't want to keep looking in the auto picker. Thank you. So yeah, once we've told all the animals we love them, we'll go out and we'll farm some fibre, because we haven't got any. And the orange, uh, orange, bloody hell! The green rain is an awesome time to go and farm it. Okay, that's the animals dealt with. Let's grab all this we can. I was, I was so upset when I found out that you could actually make refined quartz just by chucking quartz into the smelter. So this stuff isn't as important now, but for year one, 
all this fibre is an absolute godsend. Because you just use it to make the tea saplings. I might do it now, to be honest, just to kick a bit of extra cash. <laughs> Are they really? I'm sorry about that, Wandering. It's okay, little birdie, they're not off you. Forest. Small there. I'm still working on that um, that video I was talking about the other day, wondering the it's like stuff I wish I knew when I first got into the hobby. I'm actually really enjoying it. I'm just trying to get loads and loads and loads of screenshots and uh, examples of stuff. That she's fine. So much fiber. And moss, which is good. You can use the moss, the moss burgers and stuff. Yeah, man, I'm really enjoying, uh, like, sort of planning it out. Reminds me of being in university again, to be honest, doing a little project. Fiber. And also the fiddler ferns. Uh, iridium, I think, is the highest chance, like floor 60 to 80. Okay, I'll have a look. So I'm definitely in the Iridium time now. Fiddlehead Fern. I like these random little events they've put in. Adds a nice little, you know, not a massive thing, just a nice little touch. belongs to me. Oh, 
Oh, it's 5.30. I should have to get all this done before it gets dark. Hello, hat mouse. Um, don't know. I like to think it is, though. The burglar Bill and me likes to think it's stealing. I love stealing, I love taking things. bit first and the last place we've got to go is the secret forest oh it's brilliant so much fiber I think he would, to be honest. I think it's too deeply ingrained in him. Even if he paid top dollar for something, he would still consider it stolen. Right, nip to the secret forest, and then I think we're done. Hundred seventy three, it's not bad. And almost two hundred and fifty moss. See, so yeah, I need the hardwood from the secret forest as well, because you need that to upgrade the house and to make all of the um barrels and preserve jars and things. That's gonna be a huge resource investment. Moss is good for cooking with, and there's a few recipe, well, a few new recipes that require it as well. Let's grab this hardwood and we'll boogie on out of here. Nice, 615 though. Know. Who are that? Uh, it's. Oh, wait, 10. How you doing, dude? And it's 
um, basically an upgraded version of Harvest Moon from the uh, the Game Boy. Like, I goddamn loved Harvest Moon, and I still do. But this is just better. God damn it! Let me through. Yeah, I've, I had the game for ages and never played it. And then when I played it, I'm like, this is just... This is Harvest Moon, but so much goddamn better. The only thing I don't like about it is the Ginger Island part. I think it just ruins the game a bit. Because it goes, okay, you've spent 200 hours building your farm. Now you're going to go to a different place and build a crap farm. And I just I don't like it. Dump all this stuff in the boxes and go sell those to the animals. <laughs> Fair enough. Where the hell is my. Oh, maybe put them over there. out the old greenhouse. Strawberries are ready. The goddamn fruit trees cost me like a hundred grand to plant. Battle against slimes and skeletons and annoying bats and really irritating ghosts. Right, just the strawberries picked. Let's go check on the animals. Tell the animals you love them every morning. Should be 14 truffles a day. Yeah, it's a decent increase. That's the animal scene too. Let's go see what the travelling saleswoman's got. I miss a goat. Uh, I missed a chick. I did miss a goat. I missed Wombus. Well spotted there, Tent. And I missed one of the chicks as well. 
There it is. Alright, where's Wombus? God damn it, I've got so many goats. Yeah, there it is. Nicely spotted, dude, thanks. See what the traveling salesman's got. Then we'll go get the rest of the hardwood. Oh, I need to pick up my pan from Gus as well. God damn it, I can't afford the retro catalog yet. Mackie rolls. Do I need Mackie rolls for anything? Mackie rolls. I do need Mackie rolls. I do want that, but I just can't afford it at the moment. Right, hardwood. I really need to go back to the farm and plant a load of hardwood trees. Because you can only max out, get 12 in here a day. I think you need 100 for the house. And then I'm going to need hundreds more to make the kegs and the preserve barrels. And a shed load of copper, I think. Let's have a quick look at the wiki. Between 100 and 150, possibly. Okay. Yeah. Lovely truffle. Close that so I can get in and trample all over my melons. So we're going to go pick up the pan and upgrade it to gold. And we'll take the shortcut. Steel pan. Upgrade tools. Use the used to get all from the streams has bigger and better yields than the steel pan. Oh, that's expensive. Right, we'll drop this off and then we'll jump into the mine and see if we can't find some iridium. I know you're supposed to do it on like super lucky days and then take uh, food that increases your luck and all that sort of thing. I just haven't bothered doing it yet. Oh. A truffle and a fried egg. So basically, 
All I need is 10 wheat and I am good to go. Yeah, it does look like a bedpan. Friday, okay, so Pierre is still open. Let's go get some wheat from Pierre. And let's see, community centre almost completely done. Deal the wheat. And then I need that to fry an egg. So, yeah, all I've got to do is wait for the. Wait for these to grow, and I'm good to go. Uh, what was I doing? Oh yeah, I was going to have a quick look in the mine, see if there is any iridium down there. I can't afford to build, well I can, but I can't afford to build it properly. The next uh, coop. The next coop that I need, I'd have to pick up an auto picker and all sorts of other rubbish and okay monster area me of a rubbish sword my sword is absolute trash down has appeared. Okay, it's over there. Uh, no, I think it's always been about 120 levels. The Skull Cave mine is infinite, if I remember rightly. Skull Cave Mine's the one that you've got to go down prepared, like, you need staircases and all that sort of stuff. And uh, warp totems and loads of luck food and the whole ordeal. Oh, God. No. Not dealing with that. Not with this sword. Oh, yeah. Check the quarry, have I? Nice source of coal. Wigglies. Oh, 
Oh, and some more wigglies. There you go. Now we'll head back to the bus stop. It's getting late. as well. Right, let's go shut the doors on the animals because that gives you a uh, relationship bonus of them when you shut them in at night. Oh yeah, and the old truffles as well. Oh god, Jesus, thank you for that, Frost. I thought I changed it. Game title. Cheers, dude. I honestly thought I'd changed that, but apparently I didn't. I blame it, Ugg. Uh, I don't think there's any more truffles in here. No. Right, we'll just sell these ones. Not gonna bother keeping them yet. Debbie started. I'll just check in the, on the strawberries, see if the ones I destroyed have come back. Almost. And then we'll let the animals out and we'll go do the trout derby. Yeah, that when you try and use the uh, the previous stream thing that they've got, so you don't have to make it anew, there's a real good chance it's just going to merge any text you had on any other stream into it. All right, the. Okay, I think that's all sorted. Right. Fishing Derby. Oh, that's not. Oh, 
almost missed you. Right. Let's win some fish. Didn't mean to press that. And it's good for getting the fishing skill up as well. I knew it was a bloody pike. There are always little garrets doing that. couple of them now. Did I just get a bobber? No, I didn't. I don't mind fishing too much anywhere on this. It's a lot easier on the Switch, but it's not too bad on the PC. tags. Mm -hmm. 
So at least he's getting my skill up. I can sell all the fish as well. Cool, that's three. Ooh, a quality sprinkler. Farm totem. Yeah, Omni Geode. Is there any more? No, it's all three of them. Oh well, let's carry on. I'm not going to complain about being given a sprinkler, they're always useful. Come on, tags, let's go. Bucket hat, you say? That's pretty dumb. From a pink cowboy hat, though. These treasure boxes are quite lame. Oh, this is a pike. So already. Let's see if we can get one more ticket and then we'll bugger off.
Ooh, too cold. The ambassador spoils me. Ah, sorry. Don't care anymore. Done. Let's go get the hardwood and we can go sell these fishes. Forgetting, I do need to plant mahogany trees. So I think I need a hundred hardwood to upgrade the house to the next level, and sixty-five thousand. I think. So I should have enough wood for it, but I definitely don't have enough cash for it. And ahoy folks, welcome to Broadside Gaming. If you're enjoying the content, like, subscribe, bring the little bell for notifications, it really does help us out. And if you fancy it, check out the join button. That's enough shilling for now. Back to playing. Yeah, so I need to plant some mahogany trees, because I'm going to start to need an absolute metric ton of hardwood to make the preserve barrels, the casks, and all the preserve things I need, like the uh, cheese maker, that sort of thing. Why are these pigs only giving me tiny amounts of truffles at the moment? Or are they just putting them in places I can't see? Which is also a possibility. Oh well. I guess two will have to do. So in this update, shutting the doors at night actually gives you a small increase in relationship with the animals. I've been doing it since the start because I always thought it did it, but apparently it didn't until now. this crap off. Yeah, that would be quite good. Ooh. Of late fishing, nice. But yeah, that would be a really nice quality of life update. golden pan is ready. Get my bags out. I need truffle oil. Don't ask me why Mayor Lewis. Ugh. I know exactly why he needs it. And no. I'm not doing that to my truffle oil. Oh. Trees are growing, good, good, good. Means I put them in the right places. Nice, the next round of saps are ready. 
I should have done 10 by 10 really. <coughs> yeah, Mayor Pervo. I, I don't want to know what he I know what he wants it for, and it, it disgusts me. Right, today is the day we sell all the animal products as well. So let's see what we've got in the auto picker. A lot of milk. Eggs. I need to remember to keep an egg to make a fried egg for the community centre. Oh. Really? Hey, what was BG3 again? Oh, Beldles Gate 3, yeah. Yeah, I didn't know that. Take what was in here as well. Okie dokie. That should equal a hell of a lot of money. Let's go make this fried egg. So go buy some grass starters. Oh yeah, man! I I didn't realise there was just an on-off switch for it either. Go fried egg. Find a load of truffles in winter when all the grass dies off. Right. Hmm. Don't really care 
yeah, to be honest, at this point. Go to the wood while I'm standing here. Oh, I need to go pick up my gold pan as well. No, I haven't played it yet. Uh, Ugg bought it and he's had a little play around of it, but I haven't yet. I haven't had the time, to be honest, to be able to sink into um, Baldur's Gate. According to work, it's very, very good. I just I haven't looked at it. I mean, the last game I played from like that series was Neverwinter Nights, I think. Yeah, I think it was Neverwinter Nights I played. I played Baldur's Gate and Baldur's Gate 2. I think my favourite kind of D&D based game was uh, Planescape Torment, I think. Is that, is that what it's called? Yeah, Planescape Torment. Absolutely love that game. Brilliant. Alright, we'll grab the pan and then we'll go drop off the egg in the... Uh, community center. Hey, got a golden pan. I'm gonna try out in a minute. I don't think I've ever used the pan before. Was I never really finished the uh, the fishing part of it because I used to hate doing the fishing. But in recent years, I've been completing it. I mean, ah, we could, might do a little uh, playthrough on that then. So I'm literally waiting for wheat and a sunflower, and the the place is done. Oh, and 25 grand to the vault, but that's not exactly sort of reach. Yeah, I mean, I, I really enjoyed uh, Rogue Trader, and I might start playing that again. Some copper ore from that. Wonder if it's only out here that you can use it or I think there's some over there. Or is that just an I think that's just the animation of the Oh no, that's just the water animation around the side, okay. No, don't see any more. Yeah, I have no idea what was wrong with it. It just it got very, very upset while we were playing it multiplayer.
It's all going all right there. Drop that off. We'll go put the animals to bed. <laughs> yeah. Right, I don't really care about the cauliflower. Go in there. Oh yeah, if he's got a nice hat, you've got to kill him and take it. That's the only way you get a nice hat. It's the whole dead men's shoes concept, but with hats. These piggies are not producing very many truffles anymore. Don't know why. Right, I think that's everything done. Old duck feather. That's the best way to do it, man. Jeez, it's almost a hundred thousand on just milk and eggs. It's pretty decent. ready though. Another day or two. Okay, so I'm going to leave those until the others are ready and then pick them so they're all ready at the same time again. Okay, we've got a decent amount of sap maple syrup and pine tar coming in. Oh, 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 that's why they weren't producing truffles. Okay. sort this out. I didn't realise that was happening. Why aren't they coming down here to eat? Grass there. Okay, maybe I need to move some of these barns around. Oh, 
oh, this is going to cost me so much money. Oh yeah, good job I did, because uh, I'm, I'm out of... I'm out of pay, somehow. Okay, let's go deal with this. Maybe there's too many of them in one spot, I need to split them up. Yeah, I thought I saw some of them, like, them just eating over there, but uh, maybe they're not. Okay, I'm gonna have to split them up. Didn't wanna be, I didn't want to be forced to do it now, but apparently I have to. Because, like, it's right there. I thought they would come over here to eat. Oh, this is gonna sting. This is the best quality of life update I've ever seen in this game. You can now buy stuff from Marnie when she's not here if you spend 5,000 gold on the animal catalogue. Right. 30 grand on hay. Nice. Yeah, I'm going to need to split them up and buy some more grass starters because uh, this is not good. Right. Because look, there's, there's literally there's hay everywhere, like grass and edible bits all over the place. So. out quickly. At least we have to get to my goddamn silos as well. Okay, that's in there. clear all of this out and we'll move the coops over here. Yeah, I didn't think they were either. Robin, move stuff around and then we'll go to Pierre and get some grass starters. Because this can really screw you over.
Almost forgot every cut the stump out of the way or semi hidden path thing. Ever cut the stump out of the way or the semi hidden path thing? Uh, I'm not sure what you mean, dude. That's that one. And let's move the last coop. Gonna block that, so we'll put it here. All right, that, that's fine. That's the coop sorted out. be in the way. Um, just put that there. over there as well. Okay. Alright, let's go deal with that box that's in the way. I should have brought a farm tone with me, actually. Oh, the... Um where the farm totem takes you back to the little statue thing Still, I hate you, Pierre. All right, we don't have to plant that yet. We've just got that now. We'll plant that when all the animals are back in the barn. I think I know what you mean, Frost. I think you mean. I think you're talking about the statue that you actually walk back to. Yeah, it's like um, we we'll should we should see it in a second actually while I get back there. This thing up here. Yeah, that's just where you come back to from the warp totem. Oh, I need to move that box out of the goddamn way. Right, we'll leave this gate open so that the chickens can back get back to their house. Right, hopefully we can now move the barn where it needs to be. Right, I'm hoping the chickens get can get to where they need to go. Oh, I don't know if I'm going to make it in time. Yeah, the warp target. Come on, please clock off at five, not four. Nice. Come on, Mook, out of the way. Why won't it go there? Okay, you can sit there then, spaced out. That works. I think I'm gonna just put that there so it doesn't because it looks messy there. And I'm just gonna fill that with starters. Uh, 
Well, good job. I made all that money yesterday because uh, I would have been a bit screwed otherwise. Yeah, I'm not sure why they're not coming down here to eat all this. Oh, there's some of them down here. Just get, I'm going to get the trees out of the way. Maybe it's something to do with the trees. I don't know. I mean, I always need the wood, so it's fine. I thought they would just come down here. As you can see, there's food aplenty down here. get rid of all this and fence it to there and have all this as grass I don't know I don't particularly want to because that's a hell of a lot of work Okay, so I've moved all the coops and stuff. Oh, God, I should have done it. Oh, God, this isn't good. I should have done it while they were asleep in the coops. Because now they're just going to hang out down here. Oh, this is a pickle. Yeah, I, I might just, like you said, harvest it so I've got the food in the silos. But bloody things are all just sleeping out here, so I don't, I don't know whether to read. Okay, I need your advice. Should I restart the day and move them while they're in the coops? Or do I just hope that they go back in at some point? What do you think? I don't think you can herd them. No. I'm not sure what to do now. Because if I if I proceed t tomorrow and they don't go back, I can't revert the save. But if I restart the day now and move them while they're still in the coops, I'm I'm gonna scum save it. I'm just gonna restart the day. Sorry, folks. This has annoyed the hell out of me. 
I don't trust that it will either, and I can't have 40 bloody chickens stuck out there. Okay. At least I know what to do. Right. Let's take wood with me. Okay, cool. Everything's closed. So I won't open the doors. But what I am going to do is this up. this up then I need to go clear that spot up the top again yeah I just don't like doing it man it does it feels a bit you know when you're doing, when you're doing those pick your own adventure books and you're like, you keep your finger on the page it's like no no I didn't take my finger off the page it doesn't count it's like it does so we need to clear this area this is where the coop's gonna go. first then we'll go to the shop and get the grass starters and then we'll hit robins yeah maybe I just had too many animals in one spot Nine o'clock, let's go down to Marnie's. Oh yeah, if you're gonna Google every step of the way, then it's But then, you know, I don't I Play the game how you want to play it, really. No, nope, I'm not buying more animals. Stop. All right. Now we spend all my goddamn money on hay. I upset the animals that's my entire business plan ruined there we go bull 700 now we go to Pierre's just give me a second oh god I think I've just burnt my coil in my vape there what I can taste is burning now Yeah, so he can rip me off buying grass starters. And then we go and see Robin. Oh yeah, like console commands. If if your game is basically broken and you've dumped a load of 
like tens or even hundreds of hours into it. Yeah, console command that shit and fix it. It's either that or start all over again and hope it doesn't do it again. Which is not cool. Yeah, god boating stuff is just... It makes everything boring. Right. Let's get these moved. So we'll move the coops away from the barns. This time, I'm not going to lose all my animals all over the farm. Now, put it there. Let's move this thing. There means. Hmm. So I'll put some sheds there eventually. There's nothing can grow there apart from trees. So I mean that I'll have to do. I need one of these over by the coops. it there and yeah I think we are good to go right I think that that is better hopefully this should slow down the rate of attrition I was having. Alright, I don't want to forget to... I'm sorry, chickens. And duckies, I'm sorry. I'm a terrible person. I think that would explain why the pigs weren't digging up truffles because there wasn't enough food. But these guys are fine though. and stuff, but I mean, it's all right for now. I mean, I could always move these forward, but... Oh. 
Oh, they, they consume it. Absolutely rinse me through this layer. These trees out the way. So if I get rid of these trees, maybe they'll start going down there a bit. Yeah, they they can they can and will eat themselves out of everything. this out a bit. Okay, so I can plant grass starters there. That's, they've changed that then. That's good. to sort out uh, there's my hardwood I need to block these ducks in a little bit so they don't start wandering into the actual farm and messing with stuff Sweet. Well, the auto feeder should have done that, but for some reason it didn't. The only annoying thing about this now is that it's going to take me much longer in the mornings to do this because they're all bloody spread out.
Yeah, I'll put some sheds there, I think, so I can put the um, the cheese making stuff in there. I don't understand why they're not coming down here, though. Yeah, I think it that it only calculates it at the beginning of the day. Right. Crisis averted, I think. Oh yeah, I need to put the box back down for the duck feathers. Scary. Grass starts at ten fiber, Jesus. Oh, God, that costs so much to fix that. Scary expensive. <laughs> right, let's go check that everything's hunky dory. Got all the wheat we need. This goddamn tree is really irritating me. I mean, I'm going to regret this when I'm completely wood starved, but. They're annoying me. doing and now for the chickens Thank <laughs> you. 
yeah, it takes a bit longer to do now, but I mean, if it stops us from going completely bankrupt through food, then I guess it's a good thing. is completely clear, maybe they will come down to these patches and start eating. There you go, comes the duck. I don't know, we'll see what happens. Uh, they seem to, they do seem to be wandering about a bit more, so maybe there was just too many of them in one place and it all went a bit wrong. Yeah. Uh, I don't know. Don't know. Ooh, found a new shirt. Favorite place to get clothes from. Right, we'll just clear this out and we'll see what happens. So I don't understand why they're not coming down here to feed on the blue grass. Are they just very dumb? I don't know. Everything is happened. Oh, they're coming down here now. Maybe it was that there are too many trees in the way. And they're having pathing problems. Maybe. But they sit there. Yeah, they're. They're moving further into these areas now, so maybe... I don't know. I just don't know. Oh look, there's a chicken down here. Okay, so they are. Okay, I'm going to just assume it was a pathing issue with too many trees around, and it freaked everything out. Speaking of fences, where the hell did I put my hardwood ones? I'll take that just in case. Alright, I'm not going to cut these down because I may need them. It's my emergency wood. But what I am going to do. going to build a fence across here. Damn ducks. Oh, they're happy. I'll leave them alone. Oh, I won't mess with them if I don't have to. Let's check out the old greenhouse. Ooh. 
all the strawberries are in. A little bit of cash back in my pocket. Yeah, I was just thinking that it's like, like there's no point in me having a fence because these little sods are just going to jump in and paddle about. It's cute though. I didn't realise they swam even until yesterday. Let's put all this crap away, shall we? Take this wheat to the community centre. So all I'm missing now is the, uh, the sunflower. This is the sunflower. Hopefully that should be ready tomorrow. I think it will be. I honestly I don't remember I planted it. a sweet pea up there. Right, let's go close the animals in. Let's see if they left us any uh, truffles. must have really upset them because I was getting seven like an hour ago. Let's shut these doors. Let me check out the bat cave as well. into booze at some point oh yeah man that's exactly what I wanted to be Marnie's best friend Just closing the doors. So 
So this is where the original coop was when I started. But I thought it'd be better to stick the greenhouse there. Uh, what box am I dumping crap into? This one. I think that was just a mod because the one that I've got it well in the base game I think it's just on the at the bus stop is the closest one back. Hey, the sunflower's done. Just check on the old trees. They're doing all right. All right, let's let the animals out. Once I've maxed out the hearts to all of them, um, I don't have to bother opening and closing the door for them. I'll just leave the doors open so they can come and go as they please. It's just easier to pet them all if they're all crowded up in the barns and things. to destroy all the grass. Three, four, five, six. Oh no, that's right. I'm missing some am animals in here. One, two, three, four, five, six. Maybe I am. There we go. Let them scoff away. Right, we need to get back the hardwood we used to make up all those fences. Almost the end of the season. And the first day of the next season is always the scariest one. It takes so goddamn long to replow all the fields and plant and water. Right, 
that's the hardwood done. Let's go drop this stuff off at the community centre then. I think this will be the community centre completely finished as well. So all I've got to do is hand in the sunflower and then do the vault, which I can afford to do now. things. There we go. Community center completely finished. It's all done and fresh looking. That wasn't too difficult. won't work till tomorrow, will it? But now if I'm like that, I can go to the desert and get my decent sword. Uh, is this the yeah, this is the one I was dumping that stuff in. Oh, the seed thing's outside, isn't it? It's not now. It's right there. Oh, they seem to be pretty happy. Oh, I missed one of the chickens. doing for relationships with the animals. Not too bad, it seems. The, the ducks are all pretty goddamn happy. I think I'm missing a goat in that other uh, barn. Let's go have a look. Oh, 
Oh, I am. Cool, right, that's them all filled up now. Uh, I'm gonna grab some hay and stick it in a box just in case uh, I run into trouble again. We'll just get 250 of it and just hold on to it. Just in case something goes wrong. Okay, I'm getting a few more truffles now. This is used for the cows, so it'll be white. Stick this in this box. Actually, I'm going to build one to go next to the silos just so I know it's there. It'll be neat about this. space so I can actually see something. Ooh, I don't like that shade of yellow, it's awful. Orange. Yeah, that's better. Okay, so they are wandering around down here. again. And we can shut the doors now. I oh, didn't shut the chickens in, did I? God damn it. Nope, I forgot to shut the chickens in.
Okay, so that seems to be working. Hey, the bus is going again. Size in town as well. Oh, you're great. Here's the day. Apparently, the package had been appearing in people's houses containing items that they posted about years ago on the community centre boards, and then the packages are all addressed from your farm. Thanks for all. What does he say like that? Oh, yeah. I'm the greatest. Right. Harvest these melons. It's going to be an awful lot of them. Praise the Omnisire. They used the sacred engines. Fifty and all. And now for the last one. And the biggest one. This should give us a very large cash injection. So it won't be for a while yet until I can basically ignore planting stuff to make money. Almost done. I'm going to deal with the animals. I do like that um, it stops time when you pick stuff up. As you can see, it's only like 20 to 8 now, but I've been doing this for ages. sell all the eggs and stuff at the end of the week just before we go into autumn.
Right, let's go deal with the barns. Okay, last one. And done. Alright, hopefully there won't be any more problems with uh, grass. sword off this can't we sword so I can actually kill stuff properly. I do need to pick up my prismatic crystal first before I do that. I think it's in here. Nope. No box. Here? Yeah, there is. Yay, the Galaxy Sword! It's only massively better. <laughs> yeah. She really did. Spooky Skull Cave. Go. This is 
so we start getting iridium. Stupid dragon monsters. amusing. Meridian slimes. Alright, I'm gonna head back out. I'm not equipped for doing this at the moment. But the galaxy sword does make a massive difference. Magical cowboy hat. Yeah, I, I I remember. Painfully aware of that. Right, let's dump off. Uh, what was I nice dump? Those and a few bits and bobs. All right, everyone's heading back into their little houses. Six. Yeah, I think it's it's worked splitting them up. Oh god damn it, I forgot to close the doors. Should probably put another gate up there somewhere. Let's 
go close up the coops as well. Almost 150,000. soup, fried eel, parsnip soup, sashimi, chowder, god damn it, how do you, damn, there's letters everywhere. chickens first. Alright, they've all got food. Doors are closed. <coughs> it should be pretty simple today. I mean, I could upgrade the house. I do have the money for it. So I do need that cellar put in. Or basement, however you want to say it. The problem with pigs is they're absolutely useless on rainy days. But truffles are very lucrative. It's just winter and rainy days. Get nothing out of them. But I suppose goats only give milk every two days, so half the time they're useless as well. Alright, let's go see Robin and upgrade the house. I think it's just hardwood I need, but I'll take everything with me just in case. Oh god, yeah, I forgot about that. Thanks, Frost. 
it, they do provide pervy ungents for the mayor. For his disgusting reindeer games. No, don't water them. Dig them. There we go. There's the house being upgraded. I think I must have missed the berry season. Or is there not one in summer? I can't remember. Maybe there isn't one in summer. Talk to me, don't they? Gonna try and steal all of my iridium. Uh, I think she does. Cave jelly, though. So he's unlocked the back room. Get to the chase, you want me to give you loads of stuff. Good. Tube top, apparently. Yeah, from other one. To see the travelling sales lady as well, don't and get some more hardwood. All right, let's get some wood. Uh, 
Ah, I love the galaxy sword. I'm not sure if it's anything better now, but it's still a bloody good sword. So we need a cave jelly to make that fish smoker. Don't think I've got one. Let's go check out the Adventurers Guild. expensive hammer. I'm not wasting my money on that stuff though. Can't quite afford to do that yet. Yeah, the knockback on those hammers is really good. I just can't really afford to buy it right now. I would like it though. Just dump all this stuff in their respective boxes. Yeah, don't worry, Frost, I knew what you meant. Way trees. Put that in there. That in there. unhappy I have to do all that in when it switches over to full right but sadly I am gonna have to wander off though because I have a very long day tomorrow <sighs> so thank you very much for joining me folks I really do appreciate it and frost it's always a pleasure to uh, hopefully I shall see you all tomorrow for Friday's live stream uh, but just for the VOD if you've gotten this far and you've enjoyed you know like subscribe ring the little bell for notifications it really does help us out and if you fancy it check out the join button it leads you to all sorts of fancy things you can do and join and get involved with Ugh. But yeah i do need to wander off so again thank you very much and frost dude 
I appreciate it. And I shall uh, probably see you tomorrow. Yeah, enjoy the rest of your day, dude. So until then, see you later.